I reckon Declan had it coming. Hang on. You reckon if his sister dies, he had that coming? All right, maybe not that, but his house burning down. <sighs> Seriously? You want to talk about people getting what's coming to them? Ross, if karma ever comes knocking on your door, you're going to be in so much trouble. Where are you going? Things to do. Uh, you're coming out of there helping me. And who made you the boss of me? He's not the boss of you. I am. It's about time you get your hands dirty. But I've been helping Pete look for tenant farm. Online, I... yeah. You haven't lifted a finger since you got here. Uh, and Andy needs our help putting a slurry on the field. Enjoy. Uh... Thank you. They're giving you trouble. Oh, no, they're good lads. Oh. And you won't mind leaving them to help out on New Year's Eve then, yeah? No, I can't trust them not to get slaughtered and leave Zach to do all the work. night. No, Keen, I'm sorry, I can't do it. Go on, bring a man. She'll have a good time, I guarantee it. Is that going to turn into some massive blowout? Absolutely not. Promise? I promise. Fine, right, we'll drop in. If it all goes wrong, I'm blaming you. <laughs> See ya. See ya. Hey, love. Listen, I know you're not drinking, but you're invited and all. Might as well have a bit of fun before the band comes along. Oh, I'll be working. Right, well, you two are invited. As long as you promise to talk yourself up a bit. Look at my teeny bit from me, the pair of you, no offence. <laughs> Can't resist an invitation like that. Count me in. And I can definitely see you as a diva. Well, actually, I didn't like to say earlier because I didn't really think it was Brenda's thing, but we are having our very own Gangsters and Moles party here. So I'll be busy. Oh, well, you don't want to be gangsters, do you? I'm sure you'd rather be in a room full of divas. No, I can just see you three in double-breasted suits with little Tommy guns. Wow, I'm so tempted. Yeah, but we can't. Shame. Yeah, we're really busy at the farm with the slurry. So you're choosing poo over my party? She's not going either. So? So? What are you waiting for? She's obviously into you. Ask her out. Right. Me and Maura are around tomorrow night, so anything goes wrong, you answer to me. Uh, hang on, where are we going? I haven't even agreed to it yet. I've uh, found us a restaurant. Have you now? Mm -hmm. Tell me more. We'll wait and see. Oh, come on, mystery man. At least give me a clue. Oh, all right. It isn't here. OK, he might not be the most lovey-dovey man I've ever seen, but, well, I reckon he's got something special in mind. Like what? Moira, any ideas? Go on, then. Ask her out. Pete. Hey, mate. Give the man some space. So, what fancy carries do? I am going to be standing right here, dressed as a gangster's mob. Lucky me. Right. Well, in that case, I'd like to take you out and join you with the first. Celebrate New Year with Daylight. Not just you and me. Yeah, no costumes involved. Unless you want to put in a request. Oh, don't turn them down, love. Not many lads want to go out with the last that's up the duff. What? I'm pregnant. I haven't got herpes. Of course, it's just it's a surprise, that's all. Yeah, don't bother trying to explain. I get it. Oh, Priya. I'm so sorry, I thought you knew. Don't worry about it. You did me a favour. <laughs> <laughs> 